Hey guys, I'm Dove Cameron, and today I will be breaking down some of my most iconic music video looks. Boyfriend 2022, directed by Lauren Sick, off of my debut album, Alchemical Volume 1. This one also came together really fast because this song blew up completely unexpectedly. And so <laughs> Columbia was like, you have to make a video yesterday. I basically sent like a mood board to a couple different directors and I was like, I want snakes. <laughs> I want a tunnel, like a car in a tunnel. I want a woman who is going to be my energetic equal. It was really, really, really important to me that we got someone who was like star energy in their own right and that like you would write this song about. And Char was just like walked in and she literally, like I think she literally sat down. She's like, I'm a star. And I was like, yeah, you are. I was like, I was like, sheesh, let me buy you coffee. Like a piece of the and my makeup artist that day was like, it's so dark in there. Like we need to bring some kind of shine. So it does look, it ended up looking super euphoria. That was her idea. And so we were just finding this balance between like grungy, not grungy. And then like the wet hair was for specifically for like the greased skin and the snake. And so we just wanted to go with this very like steamy, like I think they even put like a grease film across the front of the lens. And so we just wanted it to feel very like, like animal, steamy, like something very sensual and touchable about that. So this was Lauren's idea, this was not my idea. I wanted a club setting, but she was like, I wanna cover the men's faces in masks and have them like moshing. And at first I was like, oh, is that gonna look okay? And you can see what started happening was because they couldn't see, they were hitting my body over and over and over again. And she kept being like, cut, stop, like you're hitting her. And I was like, no, 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 no. I think we keep it. How it translated was that they didn't give a f about my personal space and like there was no awareness. Well, me and Char see each other, lock eyes, and we have this like kind of cat-like, snake-like weaving where it's like, I see you, I'm on my way. And like this lithe thing, like, like, like cats. Ended up translating really well. Breakfast 2022, directed by Lauren Dunn, off of my debut album, Alchemical Volume 1. I had shot a music video for Breakfast al already that was a very different music video, and it was very pop girl. And I was in like a red latex suit. It was at the same time that uh, Roe v. Wade was being overturned. I was just so like debilitatingly affected, trying to do everything I could to be involved with helping educate people on what was going on with Roe v. Wade and how they could vote. It was like all I could think about. And then it was like watching myself in a fucking pop video where I was like, I eat boy like I just wanted it. I was like, there's no, what is this? And so my label was like, okay, well, what if, if, if this isn't the video you wanna make, what video do you wanna make? We came up with this treatment where we wanted to sort of reverse the roles, bring in as many women, as much diversity, brought in this incredible trans actor to play the doctor. It's my favorite music video I've ever, 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 ever done. It took a village. All of the wardrobe was rented from a studio and we didn't try them on beforehand. We just like got there and it was all of these men's suits. I was just like, I wanna be in men's suits and then I wanna be in the exact opposite. I wanted it to feel as, as much like a movie as possible and not like a pop video. You see the person's face. And then also I wanted it to be different than the 1950s look, which was the red lip and the starker cat eye. And then lastly, she's in a position of power as the male character or as women would be if, if the roles were reversed. She doesn't need to dress up for anybody. I still hear people tell me how much this video resonated with them. And that's like, what's better than that? We Go Down Together, 2023, me and Khalid, directed by Audrey Alice Fox. We just wanted something really beautiful and something that felt very like sort of industrial and cold, but then also romantic and dark and just sort of following the energy of the song. Cause you know, it's a, it's a beautiful song, but it's very pared back. We created this beautiful platform and like all of these rocks, but then we introduced like this silhouetted shot here. Like it's very industrial. Like it's just like straight out of a photo shoot, you know? So I thought it was a really interesting kind of creative and just left it, left room for the vocals, left room for the emotion of the song and, and the performance of that and like this kind of like strange movement that the camera is doing as well as what we are doing and this very languid thing like no real concept just like emotional beautiful intimate this dress was something that i gravitated towards because it felt 
distressed and it felt like it had lived a life and I loved the raw edges, but it was still romantic and also cold. I wanted the, the makeup and the dress to match this kind of melancholic thing, especially because the set was so muted. But we needed to bring some color. It was also really challenging for a while having that red hair and finding any makeup that went with it. Like, I don't know how these girls are doing it. They must just like always be, it must just always be black makeup because I, I had such a hard time <laughs> matching any colors with that hair. But we wanted to bring out the color in the dress. We wanted something that felt a little experimental. I was like, I want flecks of gold. I was impulsive. And then we diffused it like below the eye, which I thought was really fun. Honestly, I never plan anything, which is probably pre pretty bad. But I, like, I always rock up on set and I'm like, what if it's this? <laughs> all... Then I have to figure out a way to make it happen. You have more pieces of me than the this is Sands off of my album Alchemical Part One, directed by Anastasia Delmark. And my like original idea for the music video treatment, I wanted to see like two shadowy figures in like a wide shot in the desert, like doing this couple stance. My team told me we couldn't literally <laughs> bring a piano to the desert. <laughs> and we ended up going with something a bit more intimate. I wanted to kind of create this like sort of post-apocalyptic aftermath after the storm of the ending of this relationship kind of vibe. But I wanted it to be, you know, cinematic and, and like nice to look at. And all of my music videos, it's really important to me that they feel like tiny films. This dress came out of nowhere. It was like this very sort of like last minute Venus in the clamshell, super femmy, more of who I used to be, which is like what the time that the song is set in anyway. And I just wanted it to feel very vulnerable, very skin-like, very almost nude and yeah, hyper femme because that's kind of who I was when I was with the person that the song is about. My makeup was done by my incredible makeup artist and like truly one of my best friends. His name was Kale Teeter. We wanted it to feel like it was sort of lived in and wanted to still see the skin, see the lips, see the cheeks, but as well bring that kind of element of like, there, there had to be some kind of like grit to it because the, the environment was so gritty. Same thing with the hair, like we wanted to leave the hair really wild and we had this crazy wind machine where the first time it turned on Josh and I we had to stop the dance. Cause we were like, there was streaming tears, like eyelashes flying off. It was so, so wild. And so we just wanted the hair to feel very windswept and, and all of that. And I'm really happy with how it ended up looking. I'm truly not a dancer. I like can dance, but I'm not, it's not my like number one. I've had to learn. But having a really good partner like Josh, like he was doing so much of that work. Like everybody's like, whoa, nice back bend. And I'm like, he's, <laughs> he's holding me. Like <laughs> he was really doing. He was doing most of the work and he's so, so lovely. I was really happy with it. It's very, yeah, lyrical and romantic. Thank you, Allure. I hope you enjoyed me breaking down my favorite music video looks and I hope to see you again soon.